They just said that they want to be part of, you know, why would you even want to be part of Russia? Like, tell me why, as a country, why should I be a part of Russia? I don't want to be. I don't like you. <clears throat> I don't want to be a start. part of you. Yeah. Why are you know like I don't want I don't want to be a part of Russia. Russia is like a, is not a you know I mean you talk Who's about you? you know about freedom of speech. That you have even less in Russia. Five minutes. You don't have no freedom of speech in Russia. No. It, you don't have Putin, it here either. Putin like Putin and the government about. they control they control everything. I, but we were just talking about how there's no freedom of speech here either. Right. Yeah. You know? Yeah. But but there again now. But you're, they're just you're allowed, they're more they're sh- almost more blatant with it over here. Here, yeah, yeah, there's but, no but freedom. Just remember of though that the Constitution is about talking out against the government, and so you know, so you're allowed to talk out against the government, and so you know, but in, in Russia, you're not allowed to talk out against. Well, we the were government. just talking about that. Though. Ted Nugent talked about Obama, and then they sanctioned him from not playing at any of the U.S. Army bases. Yeah, but they didn't put him in jail. They didn't put him in jail, yeah. Like in Russia, they'll but put But he still got jail. punished, and like he got threatened Look at, by the, the FBI. Pussy, That's what was scary. the name of that group? The Pussy... Uh... The Hairy Pussies? The pussy? <laughs> no, the Pussy... Cat Dolls? Pussy oh, cat. Dixie Chicks! <laughs> no, no. I swear. Oh, I <laughs> they squeak. Squeak. The Dixie Chicks. Pussy. No, I know. Pussy Riot. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. They, got, they, were, they actually got put in jail. Yeah. For talking out, yeah, yeah, I wasn't far off because Dixie Chicks did have a little moment with speaking out against the. Well, he, they spoke. Yeah, out they did. Bush. Yeah, like they yeah. lost their career. Over yeah, they yeah, really one of them did. spoke out against Bush. Yeah, yeah. the Iraq War. Like and I said, which, out, which was wrong. Yeah, <laughs> it was clearly wrong. What well, he that, did. that's what's yeah. tough about this, uh, you know, Russia versus Ukraine. I I just watched Full Metal Jacket last night. Yeah, oh, yeah. are and we I, podcasting? Now? Yeah, we're yeah, just going. We're like, I was watching Full Metal Jacket, and, um, you know, a lot of people say that the only good part of that movie is boot camp. You know how we always say that? But the whole movie is actually good. Even That's when not they go true. to Vietnam? Yeah, I feel like everybody says that. Like, oh, Full Metal Jacket. Like, Well, the, the best part of it. It's the best part, but it, um, you know, it does. It's, it's very same. similar to Ukra- Russia and Ukraine. It's very goddamn similar because Putin is saying that he wants to free Nazis in, right? That's his ex- excuse, right? But that's well, not- hold on, let me finish the train of thought. Just like America said we were conquering communism. So our excuse was communism for Vietnam, and Russia's is there's, he's saying they're Nazis and stuff, and he wants them Yeah, does that make any sense? Because Zelensky is, is Jewish. He's the president, and he's Jewish. That's, that it, doesn't it, make it's sense. It's not true. Well, but go- they were. There was like a there were CNN articles just like two years ago talking about how Ukraine was super corrupt. Like they were corrupt. They needed to do something about it. Like you it. said, like who, what, country what country isn't corrupt? What country? Yeah, is they're right? all corrupt. You said yeah, that you're to right. Me when I said yes, that. Exactly. Yeah, I'll use the same one. Yeah, we, we're just as corrupt. Too. Yeah, we are. Maybe, maybe I mean, not just as thing. corrupt. I don't know. It's a lot of times. I it's think just, we are. It's our. It's sort of like a sliding scale, right? From being totally corrupt. Yeah. To being a little corrupt. Well, we're better at sneaking it. Some we're, we're, we're better, better at sneaking. At sneaking. Yeah, we're like it's, magicians. It they're is. Like, they put this here, to, so we see this. It's a sleight of hand. All the distractions. There's so many distractions. Yeah, a lot of sleight of hand. But in other countries, it's more like this is what it is. Deal with it or go to jail. Yeah, we're just not like like North Korea. Yeah, you can't even China. China. Yeah, they put you know? your whole family goes to jail. Yeah, it's, it's turning into that North in Korea. Australia, isn't it? Yeah, did, in Australia, did, did you know that know? your whole family goes to jail if you go if you get in trouble in North Korea? They'll put yeah, your whole family that's in jail. Gnarly, dude. That's nuts. But sometimes we want to suggest things like that too. There's people I'm not mentioning any names. You know, they they suggested to you know to kill the whole family. I mean, it makes sense sometimes, though. You know, you know, in that sense, like if, you know, if you, because if you don't kill the whole family, because if you don't, you know, then you don't have nobody coming against like you. Like mafiosa stuff. So you just kill everybody. Oh, yeah. cartel does that. Cartel does. Yeah, yeah. The, yeah, the like drug that, cartels yeah. do that. Shit. So it's very common throughout history. It's actually very common throughout history to kill the whole family, everybody. I know. Just totally uncles, aunts, everybody. You know, just gets killed. The little kids, everybody. So there's yeah. no one left. Yeah, you know, to have any hatred to turn against. Them. Them. And then yeah. I like struggle. Like I always say, now that I have kids, like when I think about the evil stuff that happens out there, it's almost like too much to even 
Yeah. You know what I'm saying? It's, it it's, like hurts my feelings. Or like back in the day when you hear stories of like, we're so used to hearing stories about, you know, um, you know, a tribe would come in and just slaughter the family. But think about it. We're a family. That would literally be like out of nowhere. People just rush us right now and kill Mia in front of you. Riley, put your dad on a stake. Like that's what was happening back then. Rape your wife. Rape your wife right yeah, in front of you. Like that story I told gnarly. you. And that stuff happens. I know. Yeah. And it really happens. Yeah. And it's always happened. Well, I heard, but, I heard a story. I don't know if it's true or not.